welcome back to the channel welcome back to the vlog from the great sunshine state of florida and welcome back to another video and i want to thank all the people all you guys who have subscribed to the channel i see that you guys love the ram content and you guys have been asking a lot of questions about it as far as how much i've paid um did they give me any discounts or any deals on the truck and so much so and so forth for a 2022 limited ram 4x4 um 5.7 with the e-torque um so i'm gonna go over that in this video i'm not a technical expert i'm more of a mechanic type guy so um i don't know how to put the stuff on the screen so i'm just gonna hold the camera over the the window sticker and my sales um write up and kind of go over everything um how i how it is and like how much they gave me for my trade of my 2020 ram 3500 but before that if this is your first time or not even your first time checking out the channel definitely definitely subscribe tap the subscribe button down below bell icon ding future uploads like share and comment on the videos um so as i said i'm gonna go over how much i paid for the truck in this video um i'll say it's not no technical i'm not a technical review or anything like that so i'm just gonna go over simple show you guys the sheet show you what i paid for it go over the sales um i don't know what it's called the sales report or sales write-up of how much i paid out the door with tax title licensing and trading in another vehicle and as you can see i have my hellcat back um, i'm still getting ready i'm still have to put it back together um, before I show you guys the complete thing, but now you just get a little sneak peek of what it looked like. And this, once you guys see the whole thing, you guys are going to be super duper amazed. But let me go and get into the video to show you guys how much I paid for the, um, for the Ram. Of course, you guys don't want to just hear me talk or maybe you guys you do. All right, guys. So this is the window sticker. As you can see, it's a 2022 model, um, limited. And the color is diamond black crystal pearl tricoat, which is which is a really pretty color. It reflects. Um, it's like sparkles, like gold and blue in the in the sunlight. But as of course you can see, I have it wrapped. It's a 5.7 with the e-torque eight-speed transmission. Um, all the standard features um, that comes with it. All of that, and then we're gonna go over. Um, it has the. This one has the ventilated and heated front seats, and this also have the underseat storage, and this also have the um, heated second row seats, dual AC, temperature control, heated steering wheel, storage bin underneath, not that big of a deal. Um, this does not have the 20 inch wheels. My has the 22, which we'll go over a little bit later. I do have the power running boards. I do have the spray and bed liner. The, uh, the pickup box lighting, um, lock and tailgate, automatic high beams, which is pretty cool, front LED fog lamps and LED tail lights. Um, so we're going to start into the optional features here. So for the black pearl crystal tricoat um, paint, it's an extra $100. And for the package that I have for this night edition 27M, so not all night edition packages are the same. They have different features within the uh, night edition package. Um, I'm trying to get a good look on this one for you guys. Um, so black headlamp bezels, of course, this has a 22 inch um, black aluminum wheels, uh, 19 speaker Harman Kardon system. Sounds pretty good. Tricol tonneau cover, trash, sports performance hood. I love that. It's pretty nice. I have the 392 um, gear ratio axle, which um, which comes in pretty handy because I do tow with it. Um, Anti-spin differential 495, the e-torque, dual pane panoramic sunroof. Um, I like it. Right now it's getting super duper hot, so <laughs> I have it closed most of the time in the daytime. And then, of course, my number one feature the multi-function tailgate for $9.95 for a grand total of $72,180 here. Um, 19 average mile, 18 city, 22. I have not gotten 18 city, 
I've gotten like 14 city. I've gotten 19 to 20 on the highway, but I'm sure it all depends on how how you drive as well. So pretty much, guys, that's just the this window sticker right here. So now I'm going to actually go over. Uh, I got to go and find it, but I'm going to go over the how much I paid for it and with my trade in. And as you can see, it has a base price of six three thousand dollars. So it has uh, roughly around nine thousand dollars worth of upgrades from the basic package all right guys so here i have the buyer's order or purchase agreement or whatever you call it so as you can see this vehicle right here is 7218 the vehicle purchase price for me was 68800 and that's they just ran it up to 73 and then that's a difference of 4200 then of course they've charged a pre-delivery service charge um electronic filing fee of 2349 lead acid battery fee tire fee so after that um it's minus 299501 and as we go down transfer fee 80600 prior credit or lease balance that is the balance from my um 2020 Ram 3500 high output, um, Laramie level two. Um, and then that's the minus the 2995. That's how you come with that. Then you come on down, tag fee, sales tax is kind of not, not applicable because I'm transferring my sales tax credit from my 3500, so 77 is the is that amount then i got a rebate of 3500 um dealerships some still do rebates as i said i have a really good re relationship with my dealership here i bought many vehicles from them um they're step one automotive group um they're always linked in my description um great people i work with them all the guys and you know sales people there if you ever call me and need anything ask for nate malachi damien or carol uh so i got 3500 um, rebate and then cash down of 1268 that's just a credit of my warranty that i had so it's not actual cash you can get the cash back but they just um rolled it over into that so that will be a brought the down payment amount um to 47 66 so my balance out the door tax title tag license everything else was 730812 and as you can see, the vehicle was 72,180. And I have, you know, I had a little bit of negative on my trading of my 3,500. I've only, I only owned it for one year. So 73 out the door is not a bad deal to me. I think it's an awesome deal. Um, it's only a difference of $828.12. So I'll take that any day. Um, I spoke with friends in different areas. And dealerships are charging 5,000 markup on top of the $73,000. So out the door um, with everything tax title, I believe that's a, a great price. So I just want to be transparent, show you guys everything I paid for it, my trade-in. Um, so I think it's a great price. You guys comment down below and let me know what you think or how much you guys are paying for yours. Um, it may not be the greatest deal to some people, but to me, it was well worth it. Again, as I said, for a 2022 limited Ram crew cab 4x4, um, black diamond pearl, 72 out the door, I paid 73.08. And as usual, guys, um, if this is your first time or not even your first time checking out the channel, go ahead and definitely subscribe. I got more Ram videos coming. I have more videos coming soon on the mini build, um, everything like that. And I have some other um, builds coming along. So, yep. Should I go back and do more tool reviews? I usually do tool review on Thursday. So let me know if I should go back and do tool review Thursdays. So that's the garage looking good. Um, thanks for checking out the channel. Subscribe, like, comment, share. Thank you guys.